welcome to the Ganesh Academy e-learning app. Today I am going to explain you about third chapter of chemistry. So this chapter consists of so many subtopics that is paints, varnishes, insulators, then polymers, adhesives and the lubricant. So total this six subtypes which is included in this chapter number three. So today I will explain first sub point that is paint. So, uh, in this sub point, uh, I will uh, explain you about uh, what is paint, which are the constituents or ingredients of the paint, which are the characteristics of the paint. So, all these part in detail, I will explain this. So, first of all, I am telling you what is paint. So, paint is basically a mixture of one or more pigments in a vehicle. So, it is basically a mixture of one or more pigment. So, pigment is one of the ingredients or constituents or we can say important ingredient of the paint and because of that it is basically a solid substance. So, it forms the main body of paint. So, that is why here I have mentioned it is a mixture of one or more pigments in a vehicle. And what is vehicle? So, vehicle is a liquid substance or we can say oil and which helps to form the film or the layer of paint. So, these are the basically two important constituents of the paint that is pigment and the vehicle. So, what is paint? So, it is a mixture of one or more pigment in a vehicle. So, we call it paint. So, and next slide I am telling you about the purpose of applying paint. Paint kyu apply kiya jata hai? What is the purpose behind it? So, so, through some point I will explain this. So, first one is to protect the iron and wood from wear and tear. The main purpose is we can protect the wood and we can protect the metal articles also from wear and tear. Then second purpose is to protect the wood from insects, fungus and the moisture. So when we apply the paint on the wooden articles, so we can protect that wood from the moisture because moisture and wood ka directly reaction uh, in that case does not take place. Fungus and insect ka bhi reactivity we can control. If we apply the paint on wooden article, then third purpose is to protect iron from rusting and corrosion. Okay. So to protect from corrosion. So how corrosion takes place? So that particular metal comes in contact with the surrounding condition and because of the gases or moisture present in the surrounding condition. So that particular metal gets corroded or we can say rusting takes place. So when we apply the paint on that iron article, so we can protect it from corrosion. After that next purpose is painted surface reflects heat and light nicely. When we apply the paint on the wall uh, so in that case what happens it reflects heat and light very nicely. So I fresh lagta hai in that room okay because it reflects heat and light nicely and after that uh, it provides smooth and beautiful appearance. It gives fresh look that to that particular room. It gives beautiful appearance to the room or uh, for that particular object. So these are the purposes of the paint. So that's why we paint apply. Karte. After that in next slide I will explain you about characteristics of good paint. How do we decide karenge ki this one is a good quality paint or these are the characteristics of good paint. So uh, through some characteristics, I will explain this. So, first characteristic is it should be tough, uniform, adherent and durable film. When we apply the paint on any of the object or wall, so the painted film should be tough, uniform, adherent and durable film. So, we can say that it is one of the characteristics of good paint. Okay, what tough hona chahiye film, painted film, uniform hona chahiye. You can see here in this image, okay, uniform painting kiya hai, painted surface, it looks uniform, 
एडहरेंट है मीन्स प्रॉपरली वो स्टिक हो गया है टू दैट पर्टिकुलर आर्टिकल एंड ड्यूरेबल फिल्म ड्यूरेबल फिल्म मीन्स इट रिमेन एज इट इज फॉर अ लॉन्गर टाइम सो दिस इज वन ऑफ द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ गुड पेन इट शुड बी टफ ओके इट शुड बी यूनिफॉर्म एडहरेंट एंड ड्यूरेबल फिल्म देन नेक्स्ट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स इज फ्लूड इनफ टू बी स्प्रेड फ्लूड इनफ टू बी स्प्रेड वेन वी अप्लाई द पेंट ऑन एनी ऑफ द आर्टिकल और वॉल सो वो प्रॉपरली स्प्रेड होना चाहिए सो वी कैन से फ्लूड इनफ टू बी स्प्रेड लाइक इन दिस वे एंड आफ्टर दैट नेक्स्ट प्रॉपर्टी नेक्स्ट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक इज नॉट गीट क्रैक्ट ऑन ड्राइंग दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक कि पेंट अप्लाई करने के बाद After drying, वो इस तरह से crack नहीं होना चाहिए So pen film should not get crack on drying. Dry होने के बाद crack नहीं होना चाहिए Then we call it. It's one of the characteristics of good paint or it's a good quality paint. So pen film should not get crack on drying. After that, which are the next characteristic? The film should be Washable, glossy and stable. वो washable होनी चाहिए Washable means in some of the cases if the bad quality paint is used. So in that case what happens when we apply the water on that painted surface, then what happens? Colorful water removes. Means water wash हो के वो निकल के जाता है So paint film कैसे होना चाहिए It should be washable. It should be washable means When we apply the water on that painted surface, तो वो कलर निकल के नहीं जाना चाहिए अगर पेन फिल्म वॉशेबल नहीं है सो इजिली कलर गेट्स रिमूव तो वो ज्यादा दिन के लिए वहां पर नहीं रहेगा देर ड्यूरेबिलिटी गेट्स डिक्रीज है सो फिल्म शुड बी वॉशेबल ग्लॉसी एंड स्टेबल ग्लॉसी होनी चाहिए लाइक दैट एंड स्टेबल ऑल्सो वेन दैट पेंटेड फिल्म इज स्टेबल सो इट रिमेन एज इट इज फॉर अ लॉन्गर टाइम ज्यादा दिन तक वो कलर रहेगा देन नेक्स्ट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक इज प्रोटेक्ट फ्रॉम करोजन सो वेन वी स्प्रे और अप्लाई द पेंट ऑन द मेटल आर्टिकल सो इट प्रोटेक्ट इट फ्रॉम द करोजन बिकॉज इट अवॉइड द डिरेक्ट कॉन्टैक्ट इन बिटवीन द मेटल एंड द सराउंडिंग कंडीशन सो वेन वी अप्लाई द पेंट on the metal so it protects the metal from the corrosion and also it increases the durability of that particular metal article the next property is brushing characteristics so different types of brushes available according there is a difference in their size and the structure also so brushing characteristic means that paint we can apply by using any type of the brush easily on the particular surface okay or easily on the article so we call it brushing characteristic and next characteristic of good paint is high covering power it should have high covering power so high covering power means within cum paint may when it cover up the comparatively more area so we call it high covering power kam se kam paint mein when it cover up the uh, comparatively more area more surface so we call it high covering power so with the help of one of the video i will explain this characteristic that is high covering power 